Well, you see, it was by the original libretto for this event that I was to play the lead character in Scrooge. <laughs> of course, that was before anyone asked if I could sing. Have you heard me sing? No, you don't want to hear me sing. No, 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 it was one do re me later and TJ said, <clears throat> we're gonna rethink this whole thing. And I was off the hook, thankfully off the hook, because I would have to sing and that freaks me out. Quite a bit pretty. Russ, I've heard you before, you have a beautiful voice. Why, thank you. But there I was, and all I had to do, I was out of trouble, I didn't have to go through the transformation where I had to come up with a Christmas goose and give it to some guy named Tim which is good because the only friend I have named Tim is a vegetarian. He's friends with a goose. God bless so, us. It wasn't, we all love the goose and it wasn't gonna work out. So all I had to do was send one email to the wardrobe department. What wardrobe department? Crap. <laughs> and so here I am, dressed ready to go as Ebenezer Scrooge. <laughs> But we had to throw the script out, so I have no plan, which makes it like every other Monday night. But I started thinking about it. I've got a bunch of new people here, but I also have my friends and my loved ones, my, my, my chosen family, if you will. And me. And NJ. <laughs> and with all of you, I thought, well, what you do when you get together with a room full of people is you, you start your own traditions. I've got my chosen family, and I don't have an Uncle Al amongst you. Hang on, I promised the newcomers I would talk slow. Uncle Al is a fictional character that looks just like my actual Uncle Al that I promised I would not stab with a fork at a holiday dinner this year as part of my open stage promises. So far, he lives. He's sort of like the Grinch, only you can't get your presents back at the end of the movie. Yeah, so there we were here together. No Uncle Al's, just us, and it occurred to me we could create our own traditions. I say we do it. I say we grab a big steaming mug of wassail, curl up on a couch with a loved one. If you don't have a loved one, one will probably be provided by someone here. Really, for that? For that? I'm gonna be trying worse later tonight, I swear. All right. And sit back and enjoy what is actually our first ever holiday event. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Open Stage Miss.